And we know that there's no way to stop criminals from coming to safe circles and going through this process. Um, what happens if they do that, though, and set up a bogus account and attempt to communicate with children on safe circles? That would be a huge mistake, a huge mistake for criminals to make. And here's why. First of all, it gets back to almost what we were talking about with the bullying. There's a lot of people that are going to be able to see what's going on. Our moderators, the parents, the victim, the, the, the students that may be the victims are the intended, the target, all of that. If a, if a criminal is dumb enough to go and register for a safe circles account, have their passport photo made, and then come in and set up some bogus account like he's a child, you know, and he's going to utilize this to try to victimize a child. Well, whenever a predator or a molester, you know, reels in a child through the internet, there's different phases that they go through. And as soon as they get into this suggestive talk, they're going to be seen. Okay, but here's the problem for them, and they've never faced this problem before. They are not anonymous at all. What's going to happen is this. If a parent or a moderator or anybody reports this is a suspicious person, this person just ask a child, are your parents at home? Are you alone? Do you have one of the, the, the key questions that these predators and molesters, you know, this is not right, something's going on. Here's what we do. We contact law enforcement. All right, now, law enforcement knows that this person exists. Law enforcement can find out through us exactly who this person is, a picture of this person, their address, everything about this person. This person has no knowledge that this is going on. Now we've got a situation where law enforcement can set up a steam on them. Law enforcement can come into safe circles like they're a child, and they can start communicating with this predator that was dumb enough to come in there and try to victimize children, and all of a sudden, we've got a predator, an online predator, that an online sting is being set up against a real person, a real person, not an anonymous person. And the first time that that criminal's gonna know that law enforcement's on to him is when he hears that on his front door, and they're right there with the handcuffs on. That's the first time he's going in that. Never before has that situation ever existed. That, that has never existed before. The worst thing in the world a criminal can do is try our system. They'll be in jail before dark. There is no way they can function inside a safe field. Our safe service can't do it.